Hey guys, it's Claire. So today I'm going to be doing a two-part, possibly three-part kind of like type video where I'm going to be showing you how to show your house pride on Animal Jam. So as you guys know, I really, really am obsessed with Harry Potter. You could probably tell by my last video. And once again, I'm so sorry that's really long. I know a lot of you guys decide not to watch that video. And I'm so sorry. I'll try not to make long videos. That's why I said this video might be two parts. But I'm going to be making two versions of this video. One is going to be for members and one's going to be for non-members for showing house pride. And I will say if you're a non-member, you'll be showing like your pride for every house and not just one house specifically. But, you know, we had to get creative. We'll make it work. So I might do a two-part member part, but we'll just see how it goes. So if you hear paper, that's just my list of stuff and I have outfit ideas and decor so without further ado enough talking let's get right into the video okay so first of all if you hear any noise in the background that's our neighbors and also we have the washing machine going right now so I'm sorry okay but I'm gonna start with clothing so once again this is the members video and we're gonna start with clothing today so um like flower crowns the spring flower crown does come in all the colors for your house so that's always a good choice you can also do the butterfly hair bow which i forgot to write this down whoa sorry that's my pen so i'm gonna write that down real quickly butterfly hair bow um and you can get them blue so ravenclaw that's a sneak peek for the other video Okay, so the gardening hat is a great choice. It comes in different colors. You do have to get creative. I was thinking this one would be for Hufflepuff. Just saying, comment down below. Like, this would be for Ravenclaw, so you can let me know what you think. Um, the investigator's hat does come in quite a few colors. It will look nice. If you want, you could do the flag. The flag does come in all the colors. And the flower crown, um, this would be, Ra no, this would be Gryffindor, Hufflepuff. This would be Ravenclaw, and this one would be Slytherin. Um, I'm so sorry. I only don't friend you guys. I'm not trying to be mean or anything. I just don't do that because, you know, it's a video, and I'm very sorry. <laughs> if I don't know who you are, I might not accept you. So, um, I do apologize. Um, also, if you are, like, if you're a Doctor Who fan, the Fez, I put this in another video. But you can check it out if you want. You can also change the color. But I think it's cool that the main color comes in red. So, for you non-members, there you go. Uh, the, sparkle, the sparkly boa comes in a lot of colors. So, if that's your style, you could wear that. That's a great choice. Gazelle horns come in all the colors. You do have to get creative with Ravenclaw, though. The Shatter Shades look really really great they come in all the colors the tutu is another one of those items that I think will look good to show house pride fairy wings uh, for I was thinking those orange ones that I just passed I passed them again that would be good or you could do this for Gryffindor either one would work the mustache comes in lots of colors and this video is kind of fast because I just want to keep this at a nice fast pace so I don't bore you guys the beaded necklace is a great choice. Um, also, the leg armor, I think, will look really good. Just saying. And then, of course, you could get the round glasses. So, this is also in the non-member video. But if you remember, you could change the color. But it's kind of cool if they come in red, which is, like, super helpful if you're a Harry Potter fan. The leaf necklace would also be a good choice if you want to go matching with your other thing. Uh, your leg armor and the star cape is also a non-member item but if you change the color it could go for a certain house same with like the necklace I know the necklace is one of the, like the boringest items but you could do that and the wings also look really great for the different houses okay so those are my ideas for clothing and now on to decor so for decor I'm thinking like you would want let me find these items. Oh my goodness. I feel like I'm not even like going off of my list. I'm just like kind of winging it. But anyway, um, there's lots of good items like 
the vanity and mirror will look nice. The koi pond will look really nice. Uh, for House Pride, though, the heart pillow does actually kind of work. It almost has all the colors. And star pillow as well. The circular chair, it comes in all the colors. It looks nice just because it looks kind of like something you would have. The scented candle is another good option. It comes in four different scents. I think this would be Hufflepuff. This would probably be Gryffindor, Slytherin, and, well, actually, no, this would be Hufflepuff. These would be Hufflepuff. This would probably be Ravenclaw. This would be Gryffindor, and this would be Slytherin. So, um, yeah, because Hufflepuff's right by the kitchens. Yeah. Another thing is J.K. Rowling said that Hufflepuff is sometimes her favorite house because... It is. Look it up if you don't believe me. So that's why Health Puck is awesome. <laughs> I'm just like trying to find some items. Okay, the wavy bookshelf. I know that this is a non-member item, but I want to point this out to members because you can change the color of it. And the fancy tall candelabra looks really like Hogwarts y. If you want, you can do the fancy bouquet as well. They both work. Um Okay, the fantasy banner. It is a non-member item, but I really want to bring this one up a lot because it is like the perfect thing. It's like they made it just for us guys. They made it for the Hogwarts fans, obviously. Okay, so not Hogwarts fans, Harry Potter fans. So the giant crystal looks really like Hogwarts-y. The fancy fireplace, I know that this isn't really like house pride, but it makes, it gives the feel of a common room. So... It's just an idea. The curved sofa is another really good choice. It comes in all the colors. A lot of these items I'm showing you guys come in a lot of colors. Uh, the Clever Claws dresser is another one of those non-member items. But if you're a member, you could change the color to fit the theme. Although, like I said, some of these look a little more like a child's room like that. So just beware like that. Because we want to make them look older. Okay, the diner stool is great. Um, you can change the color. This is another non-member item, but members, you can change the color. The welcome mat is another good choice. Um, it actually looks fine the way it is, but if you're a member, once again, you can change the color. Oh yeah, avoid the laptop. That does not fit it at all. Okay, so for mats, you if non-member item, change the color. It looks good. Same with pillows. So sorry for not finding you. Uh, the wall torches look really great. They give the feel. If you can do that. And the map is another great one if you're like Harry Potter with the Marauders map. The tea party table. This is a great choice actually because there's all the colors and you can change it to what you like. And I actually didn't know that the, bean ba the bean bag chair was a members thing, but you can change the color and it'll work. Same with the striped sofa. If you change the colors, you'll find one. And that is a non-member item. And so is the tiki torch, but the tiki torch does give a good feel. Um, also, the pink lamp is a great choice. You could use that one as well. Um, as for like wallpapers, I'd say the dust striped walls would look really nice. And for flooring, I don't really know. Maybe like the stone, I'm the slate floor, or like the yellow diner tiles, or the brown tile. So, um, yes. And I'll be right back. Okay, so here at Epic Wonders, um, if you go here, Basically, all the elegant selections, so the elegant curtains, the elegant hanging rug, the elegant table clock, and I'm so sorry for my mouse, it's probably really annoying. The sconce, the coffee table, the chair, and the couch, they would all look really nice. Sorry, they're all members, but they would look really nice, and if you don't have a lot of gems to spend, that's fine. And I actually didn't mention this in my list, but the elegant table will actually look really good if you were, like, having a party. So, like, just look around because there's lots of items that look kind of Hogwarts related. So, um, yeah. I would also say that the firefly necklace would be great for, like, potions if you wanted to wear that. I think I'm going to sneeze. This is another good option, the branch antlers. And I think that a lot of these items will look really nice on your character. So just, like, look for that. And, oh, wow. Hey, I love your 4th of July. That looks great. And also, I would like to give a shout-out to, where is she? A shout-out to one of my friends. I don't know who she is. I forgot her username. Who are you? 
Oh, you're not my friend. Um, sorry, that's... Oh, LPS lover. Are you her? Yes, I think you are. Um, is this, like, some glitch? It must be a glitch, because I swear that yesterday she was wearing 4th of July stuff, and she looks so great. So, okay, I think I have one more item to show you, and then I'll see you guys next time. So the last item, oh my gosh, the last item I want to show you is the Mysterious Cloak, and I know that it's in the diamond shop, but if you have two diamonds, I mean, it looks horrible, no offense to anyone, on the Arctic Wolf, but it still looks really great. Like, if you got it in black, then it looks kind of hypocrisy. I think it looks adorable on the bunnies. I'm not sure, but I think it is. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. I will not be doing a part two for the member video like I was thinking in the beginning, but I will be doing a non-member section. So I'll see you guys next time. Bye!